Ladies and gentlemen, we are back to somewhat sunny Vancouver. Today's an exciting day with three of my children that I had not seen for a while. That's right, we're going to pick up the Range Rover, we're getting the Performante ready to ship, and we're also gonna see the McLaren, the progress on that build, which is probably the most exciting thing. Life is good, it's not raining, that's really great for Vancouver. I'm excited to take you guys along for the ride. Let's go. Here's my exciting ride for the day. It's gonna be the APC at least. Buy Nissan Lyft. Ooh, look at this thing right here. All right, guys, here we go. APC. I can see the Performante through the glass. There's Bobby. How you doing? What's going Welcome on, back. man? <laughs> you keep this thing safe? We did. What was the we top did. speed you reached? I can't try it out with you. <laughs> this is like a crime. It is a crime. Look how high the car is. The lift is yeah. up. Yeah. Why would you guys do that? We just moved it. That's the worst part is you got the bag GTR beside my lifted Performante. <laughs> guys, let's take another look at this wrap. Ceramic Kings absolutely killed at this side profile. And then this hood livery. We spent an ungodly amount of time designing this and it is executed to perfection. Other than lift me up. I just got the guys quickly back in here. Nice. Bobby, you even cleaned it for me? I did. Holy smokes, I don't think I've ever seen this thing so clean. We got the brick stins here. Buddy, wait till you hear it. The wrap. Oh, yeah, yeah. You said you haven't heard it though? I have not, no. But the rumor on the street, it sounds good. Service over the top. This thing is, I could eat off this car right now. From our friends. Look at this stuff. Oh, and check out these Driven Project ammo tanks. We have so much ridiculously awesome stuff coming your way. I actually brought this for you. For me? Wow. It's a Driven Project gift box. Wow, awesome, thanks. Yeah, man. there you go, man. There's a few goodies in there for you. All right, guys, we're gonna do a cold start. First time I've heard the new Great. exhaust set up. Velocity AP. I should have put earbud earplugs in. <laughs> I don't know what's louder, this or the Lambo. <laughs> that the Lambo is definitely louder. <laughs> There's a reason why the guys didn't want me to hear it. Years the first time we oh my god, that is a beautiful thing. Lost the AP, killed it. First order of business anytime I get into a car. <laughs> All right, first drive. Oh, it sounds so good already. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, you ready? Let's Here we do go. It. Wow. <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> in the SBR with the Velocity AP downpipe and tune. Absolutely insane. This thing's like a new vehicle. Honestly, I didn't know what to expect. Sounds like a completely different vehicle. We're definitely gonna have some fun with this. The goal is obviously always to make something that's fun for kids. They're gonna have a great time with. This thing is now absolutely insane. So thank you guys, Velocity AP in Kelowna. Check them out. They've got some awesome stuff and we always wanna make sure we support people who support the German project. I really like the SBR as a daily, uh, I think aesthetically the sound, like the interior actually fit inside the car which is rare. Um, <clears throat> truth be told, I was getting a little bit bored of the SVR. I've had it for probably about two years now and uh, hadn't really done anything with it since I initially got it. it. had the Quicksilver exhaust, which you can see down there with the carbon fiber tips. I did the bricks and wheels, I did a wrap, and it was just, I don't know, I guess, like I said, I was just getting a little bit bored with it. The tune, the downpipes, and the pulleys from Velocity AP just absolutely woke this thing up, gave it a whole new life. I'm super stoked. I can't wait to show you guys this thing because it sounds absolutely nice. It doesn't even sound like a Range Rover anymore. I don't know what it sounds like, but kind of like a crazy possessed like machine gun SUV. It's crazy to think that this thing is just 
just their support vehicle. This is the thing we use to haul people around when we don't have enough supercars for everybody. So huge thanks to Velocity AP. They came through huge on this. I don't trust just anybody with my vehicles. You know, there's a safety element. You need that reliability. I trust the Applewood guys with all my vehicles. They just did an oil change on the Lambo. They're doing brakes on the GTR and they just did the pulleys, downpipes and tune for the SVR. So three out of my four vehicles have actually had service here. And of course the McLaren is just inside there right now getting torn apart for the 1016K. Obviously goes without saying these guys are highly reliable, highly competent and I trust them explicitly. Applewood Performance Center, APC, Applewood Auto Group. Thanks you guys for all that you do for the driven projects. Can't thank you enough. Cold start. guys let's go get an update on the 720 it's in the shop here or do you got the hood off let's go take a look at this 1016 carbon fiber hood get in there real close this one piece alone is going to transform the look of this car it's going to help that uh, that black and orange contrast flow from front to back we were asked if we were a lot of people been asking like gonna wrap the hood partially like some people do i think we leave it all black because it just flows perfectly into this roof and then the the rear exhaust area i think it's gonna look awesome what do you guys think should we wrap the hood at all to try to match i don't think we should but check this out i miss this car so much by the way and there's the factory hood getting packed up someone just asked me what do you do with all the factory parts because i have a whole massive amount of parts and wheels from the performante same now with the 720 the answer is i have a storage locker it's loaded with supercar parts that factory helios orange color on the inside of the hood there all right guys we just unwrapped the carbon fiber door sills these are absolutely insane i think this maybe weighs about a pound no no not even like maybe half a pound or a third of a pound look how thin that is this is just a little aesthetic feature now what i will say i was just saying to the guys is i'm slightly worried that kids getting into this car are just going to absolutely destroy this carbon but you know what it's worth it all right the carbon hood's going on first look right here carbon fiber canards so the front end it's gonna go right about there look at this hood and the carbon fiber doors. Guys, this is insane. I feel like a kid in a carbon shop. Look at this. Get it, kid in the carbon shop. Look at all this gorgeous 1016 carbon fiber getting unloaded. We still got the wing back here. All right, guys, that's a wrap for this one. Sign off here from APC. I think you guys have seen enough of the carbon 720S coming together. Four different projects going on with four different cars, the Lamborghini, the McLaren, the Nissan GTR, and the Range Rover SVR. Different project fleet is getting nuts, but it's about to get even nuttier. I'll leave you with that, and we'll see you guys next time. If you haven't done it already, gently subscribe to that smash button. Oops.